Hello and welcome to the Slingshot channel. Lousy weather today again, I'm afraid, but I'll try to entertain you anyhow. Recently, I presented this Lego shooting pistol to you. That can be cocked like that, and then you can muzzle load a Lego brick, and then slid it in, and then shoot. <laughs> That's a pretty powerful and cute pistol, I think. But it did not manage to penetrate ballistic gelatin with a regular Lego brick. And even when we use this total bad ass nail equipped part, we could not penetrate a coconut deep enough to cause some zombie death. So I had to make a new weapon. And here is what I came up with. Meet the Lego brick sniper rifle railgun. <laughs> Let me show you its features. Because accuracy was already really good with the pistol, I decided to even make it better by using aluminum rails. The barrel is quite long, it's actually a full meter. It has a scope, because I'm hoping that I can really hit something even from distances like 30-40 meters. And um, of course it is a lot more sturdy than the pistol, since we will be using more force. And of course it has this beautiful LEGO logo here at the stock. It also has a method to clamp in the ammo, so the ammo isn't slipping out of the uh, rail barrel. And, uh, but of course, this time uh, the distance is larger, so I made one that actually lifts up this wooden piece. So the wooden piece puts pressure on the ammo when it's in the chamber. And um, then of course uh, you can at any time release it again, like that. For distance shooting it is too wet outside today. My equipment would not endure it and also uh, the wood is unprotected at this point. Uh, but we can do some impact tests and then I promise to make some distance shooting later. Alright, let's first shoot a straight Lego brick into the ballistic gelatin. Uh, didn't work. Even though it didn't stick, it actually penetrated a little bit. You can really see the blocky impact it made. And now we're trying the nail equipped one. Ha! So this was a major impact. As you can see it penetrated quite deeply but also it kind of spliced open the entire ballistic gelatin block. Wow! Now coconut time! And fire! Wow! That was deep enough! So where the pistol lacked, this one here did the job. Wow. <laughs> the whole thing penetrated. Unbelievable. I think this is a dry coconut. No more water inside, but that was a zombie kill, all right. From here underneath the tree, we can probably wager one shot against the broadside of my barn. See how they fly. All right, load it in. That's it. And fire! Wow! <laughs> wow, it sticks in real deep. Look at this, it's the same size. I'm not sure how, if I ever will be able to pry this out again. I hope you enjoyed it because that's it for today. <laughs> Thanks and bye bye.